Welcome back, everybody. I'm Katie Wilson, and I have a very special guest sitting next to me. And uh, you got a, a big crowd here. Yeah, it looks like it. What's up, guys? Everyone, How you doing? Welcome, Jeremy Shotta. From Adventure Time. From Adventure Time and Voltron. But how many Adventure Time fans on the, are there in the crowd? Lots of you? Okay, cool. Yeah. Awesome. Well, that's good, uh, because I also brought with me a very special guest that you Adventure Time fans will super appreciate. Uh, my good friend Olivia Olson, who plays Marceline. She's going to come crash the panel. Yeah. Come on out come here, Come on Olivia. out. Give up a big round of applause for the lovely Olivia Olson. Hi. Sweet. Hello. I'm happy to have you both here. Yeah. How has your con experience been so far? Great Fantastic. so far, yeah. I just got in. I just got in yesterday. Uh, did some stuff for Voltron, and now today I'm on the show floor signing, taking selfies, all you beautiful peeps, uh, and uh, just hanging out. It's been good. Yeah, I've been signing over at the Boom Comics booth. So after this at four, I have a signing. If you're not at Jeremy's panel, which you should probably be at, <laughs> but after, yeah, we have a Emerald Com Emerald City Comic Con exclusive Marceline comic that I'll be signing over there. So come say hi. <laughs> so I notice a lot of cosplay here. Yes. Does that ever get crazy to see? You know, I think we've like been seeing cosplay for like so long at this point that you kind of get used to it, but it is still crazy to think that like it's so weird to be at a place where like that's normal. Yeah. I'm like, oh yeah, that's somebody's dressed up as Finn. That's just normal. Yeah, I you was know? like walking into the Sheraton next to a guy dressed as Finn earlier, and I was just like, this is normal, you know? <laughs> just <laughs> used to it. You don't even like do a double take anymore, which is just, it's come such a long way. The first time that I ever saw any Adventure Time cosplay uh, was it our very first time at San Diego Comic Con. And at that point, there wasn't any official merch yet, so it was basically just people making their own homemade. We had, there was like a whole family that was all, like the dad was Ice King, the mom was like a bubble gum, like one of the sons was Finn, and they had like a little baby who was dressed in a little Gunter outfit, a little penguin. <laughs> so super cute, cute super cute. Um, and no one knew who we were at the no, time either, so I was going up to those cosplayers, like, can I get a picture with you? And they're like, no. <laughs> <laughs> so have you guys cosplayed as your characters yet? I have not. No. Why not? I sort of did. I did it for Halloween because I didn't have a costume. You were super lazy at last minute. Was like, yeah, oh, well, and I what had to I go to a Halloween with? party, and I had her uh, sweater. So I was like, well, I'll just throw on some vampire teeth. And yeah. uh, I think probably the reason I've never like cosplayed as Finn is because I feel like if I ever do, and there's like a picture of it, it's just gonna be like in memedom for forever after that point. What is wrong with that? Yeah, I, Am I well, right, I guess, guys? Yeah, I guess you got me there. I feel like people already do their edits of me in that enough yeah. anyway, so I'm just like, they got it covered. They got I it don't covered. know. How many of you guys out there think that he should cosplay? <laughs> yeah, I definitely think oh, so. Oh, dang it. <laughs> so I kind of want to take us back a little bit. How did you guys get your start in acting and voice acting? Uh, for me, I started acting from a pretty early age. I was about five or six years old, um, and I had started in on-camera acting, which I, which I still do, uh, quite a bit of, and I just always loved, like, movies and TV shows from an early age, just always had an interest in it, and once I kind of started going out and working my way up through doing, like, little guest star parts and things, and, like, commercials and stuff, I just kept working, and then the agency I was with had a voiceover department, and so then they started sending me out for, for VO stuff, like radio commercials, whatever else, uh, and then at about 12 years old is when I, uh, when I booked Finn uh, on Adventure Time, and at the time, my older brother Zach actually did the voice in the original uh, short when it was like a Nickelodeon cartoon, and then that was like three years earlier, and so they just kind of figured whoever did it initially, his voice had changed. And I got the job, sounded just like him, and I've been doing it uh, ever since. And nobody knew I was his younger brother until the first day of recording. They just thought they got very lucky with someone who sounded just like the original.